Hi students, hello everyone. So tomorrow we have uh, BW examination. So the most important topics in a BW examinations for average students and slow learners. So better to prepare unit 1, unit 2, unit 3 and unit 5. If you read 4 units, out of 4 units you will get 75 out of 75 marks. Coming to the unit 1. The most important topics are focused topics are mesh analysis, nodal analysis and theorems and these are part 1 and coming to the part 2 is transient analysis of RL series circuit and RC series circuit. If you, you remember for any problem the 5 points are very important Kitchoff's voltage law, Kitchoff's current law and open circuit properties, short circuit properties and Ohm's law. And coming to the second unit, single phase AC supply is given to R, L, C. For these three, you should write voltage equation, current equation, instantaneous power and the average power and waveforms. If a single phase supply is given to RL, RC, RLC circuit, so voltage triangle, impedance triangle, instantaneous power, waveforms and uh, average power. So active power is Vi cos phi, reactive power is Vi sin phi and the apparent power is Vi. The most important and repeated question in the previous year's examination are, is define phasor. What is the phasor representation of an alternating quantity? Explain briefly. So this is the most important question. And the problems on RL series circuit and RC series circuit also very important. And uh, this is one part and the second part is resonance. In a second unit, second part is resonance is a important and FR is equal to 1 by 2 per root LC that is called the resonant frequency and resonance condition is XL is equal to XC and the bandwidth is equal to F1 minus F2, sorry F2 minus F1. The proof is also very important and coming to the third unit. The most repeated question in the previous year examination is EMF equation of a single phase transformer and the problem on EMF equation of a single phase transformer. And uh, construction and principle of operation, we go through it. And uh, problems uh, and efficiency and condition for maximum efficiency. And after that, uh, coming to the three phase, star by star, delta by delta and delta by star and uh, star by delta. So the four connections you go through it. In the part one before three phase transformer, part two is three phase transformer and auto transformers. And uh, for auto transformer, step down auto transformer is very important and the problems on auto transformer, step down and step up, you go through it. And coming to the fifth unit, MCB is very very important. Low voltage switch gear means uh, fuse after that HRC fuse and then we are going for the circuit breakers MCB miniature circuit breaker and molded case circuit breaker and these two are very important and uh, types of wires and cables this is also repeated in a previous year's examination if you read 15 it or 30 unit or second or first in it you should not leave any topic so after that uh, energy consumption calculations and uh, what is the disadvantage of the low power factor, how to improve the power factor. So that is also very important. And uh, coming to the fourth unit, in a fourth unit the most important uh, topic is induction motors. So construction and principle of our operation of induction motor and how the rotating magnetic field is produced in a three phase induction motor. The resultant flux phi r is equal to 1.5 times of phi m. So this derivation is important. And what, how many types of rotors are there? Salient pole rotor and non, sorry. So coming to the fourth unit, uh, construction and principle of operation of three phase induction motor is important. And the most important part is how the rotating magnetic field is produced. 
in three phase induction motor so what is the phase diagram and phi r is equal to 1.5 times of phi m and this derivation is important and there are two types of rotor skrill hitch type of rotor and uh, slip ring induction motor and what is the slip the problems on slip and the problems on uh, emf equation of a rotor under running condition what is the power factor under running condition all the formulas whatever i gave uh, in the class that is uh, very very important